Hi guys, it's me Jen and Kathy Cat, and we are here to do a style swap video. But we are not just doing one video, we are doing two videos. We are doing a collaboration together. So if you head over to Kathy's channel, Kathy Cat's channel, you will see me in Lolita. Yes. It's gonna in, be good. In this kind of fashion. I have never worn this kind of fashion in my life. But I've always wanted to, I've always wanted to try it out. And Kathy is giving me the chance to do it. And here, you're gonna transform me into a Oshara girl. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> beige, blacks, whites, this kind of stuff. But I'm so excited to see you like muted. I don't wanna say muted because like, muted. <laughs> but it kind of is, you know, like basic. Welcome to the basic land. Okay, I'm gonna try land and basic. Be basic. <laughs> <laughs> I, I've always seen you makeup, and mm. I was always wondering how I would look with that kind of makeup, because yeah. mine is flashy, my fashion is flashy, my makeup is flashy. Yeah, but I like that. I'm going to be doing Kathy's makeup, fashion, doing it all, so stay tuned. Let's do it. I made Kathy take up all her makeup, and we just have a slight base on, and I would like to start with a little bit of concealer, okay, if yes, you're okay please. with that. Yes, sir. And I yeah. brought a fresh beauty blender to use on you. So I'm gonna just put a tiny bit of concealer. This is also like a yellow base, so. You said you are a little bit of a yellow base? Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. I have slept. <laughs> I am awake now. I am awake now. Look at me having no rings under my eyes. What is like the thing that is the most important for you when you do makeup? Oh no, sorry, what? <laughs> oh um, no, for it's me, not a good song to hear now. A, a good base, a good I think. Base. Yeah, something that's gonna last me all day. So I just wanna get you to look up, okay? Do you use powder when you do your makeup? Uh, it dries my skin out way too much, so I try to only use powder on like my nose and stuff. Oh no, I'm gonna be putting powder on you. Oh dear. Sorry. Ugh. Ew. No, you're beautiful, don't worry. <laughs> I'm gonna pick up this loose powder though. Trust and believe. Trust and believe. Trust We're stepping out of your comfort zone. Yep. That's the point. Yep. What is the most expensive makeup item you have? Makeup or just beauty products? Like makeup. Hmm. Fenty's pretty expensive. Mm -hmm. I have some Fenty products from Rihanna. <laughs> <laughs> Trust and believe. Trust believe. You are going to be Trust out of your believe. comfort zone. Yep, that's the I am point. already out of that comfort zone. Yeah. It, way out. I'm like on a, on a tricycle, cycling <laughs> out of my comfort zone. Oh my god, adorable. Yep. You have Sailor Moon brushes. Yes, I do. Have you no. ever worn bronzer before? No, because we usually, like Lolita Fashion, you make yourself as pale as possible. Mm -hmm. So having bronzer on is kind of a new concept for me. Oh, uh, well, <laughs> you're going to have some color today. Mm -hmm. Look at me. Oh, my hands are freezing, right? You know they say that if your hands are cold, your heart is warm. Oh really? Okay, great. Yes. So by putting bronzer on, it makes your face actually look smaller. Oh, well, it's a good thing. Which is like, I thought it was, I guess because you guys want to be pale, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Do people in Lolita ever use like a contour shade, like a gray to put here? Oh, uh, you, you, you can sh like light and shadow, you can make use of that, but you generally don't try to look darker. You try to look pale, as pale as possible, like a little porcelain doll. Yeah. When's the last time you've worn like basic everyday makeup? Fashion. Basic everyday fashion. Um, I guess in Germany, I was just like wearing comfortable stuff. So. Mm -hmm. Because I didn't want to bring all my fashion over. And well, it's so like much that. work to bring yeah. it over. Like, you'd have to bring so many suitcases, no? I generally wore just comfortable things, but I also would try to do what I tried to do is give my Sorry. skin a detox time. Mm -hmm. So while I was there, I tried to keep makeup and everything to a minimum to just give my skin some time to breathe. Because when I work, I sometimes work seven days a week. So yeah, you're so busy. Your hustle game makeup. is something to be admired. Hustle girls, hustle! Okay, so I'm gonna just contour you a little bit. What's the trick to contouring? Um, finding, like, kind of like where your ear is, mm -hmm. right here, and come down. Mmm, so much darkness in my face. Light and darkness are uniting mm -hmm. in this makeup for the perfect creation. I'm gonna use this ColourPop palette that I handmade from one of my videos, and I'm gonna go in with this color here. It's a cool tone brown taupe, and I'm gonna get you to close your eyes. I'm warning you, uh, I have uh, okubutai, that's what they call it, I mm -hmm. think in Japanese is 
which means my eyelids they eat quite a lot of product really it disappears so you want to see three two one gone ah <laughs> you know what i mean okay. <laughs> yeah you just got to put your product up higher i'm gonna go in with this color now just to darken up the outer corner here and this color is called cloud nine i find it interesting that you pick it up from there and then you work it in your fingers so i like to pick up the makeup and obviously tap it off um on my hand because it's always good to start in like small steps mm -hmm. and you can build up a color because if you have too much product and you put it right on your face then that's it there's no going back mm -hmm. you know so that's why you see me putting it like that on my hand because like we do makeup styles we do our makeup differently right so when you were doing mm -hmm. makeup I was like ooh, we're going for it but bold is what you do so mm -hmm. it works for you right like you want that product yeah. You know, like you don't want to lose that product. Mm -hmm. But you're trying to keep it natural. Yeah, for me, I want it to look like more seamlessly blended, I guess, mm -hmm. in a way. I don't know. Makeup's an art. Never let people try to like put you down or tell you you're doing your makeup wrong, you're doing this, you're doing that. You must be getting that a lot of your channel though, on you. Like people go like, no, you're not supposed to do that. Um, people hate because I draw fake freckles on my face, but honestly, I don't really care. <laughs> I don't know. Just... I totally want them freckles. Give me them freckles. I'm gonna give you some freckles. Yeah. Some people say they can't live without mascara. So if you had to only choose one product, two products, two products, Kathy. If you had to choose two products that you had, you could only use. What two would you use? Uh, because my hair is currently dyed a lighter shade, I need my eyebrow concealer. Mm -hmm. Otherwise I have to wear dark brows mm -hmm. right now. I really don't like that right now. Mm -hmm. So once the brows are lighter, it, everything works better. Mm -hmm. So that's going to be my number one. And then I think mascara, number two. Oh really? Mm -hmm. I'm like foundation? <laughs> Alright, I need a concealer at least. What one need... video of last year mm -hmm. gets surprisingly big on your channel? For me? Mm -hmm. Like you're like, I didn't expect anyone to like it that much. My Cebu video <laughs> mm -hmm. kind of just took off. Like for me, 30,000 views. That's good. So like for me, that's a takeoff video. Mm -hmm. I'm like, oh dang, like why? Well, I think it's because I was in a bathing suit. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> I think like for me, it was the Shinkansen video. I was oh. just like, hey, I'm going on to the Shinkansen. People the Shinkansen, man. Yeah, it was, it was. It, it, it went off. I didn't expect it. Did you like eat food and everything on mm -hmm. it? Of course you have to. You gotta get an ecky band. Exactly. She Did you have a an journey is not the same without a cute bit ecky band. I went and selected my ecky band. Mm -hmm. Ate my ecky band. I had a really good seat, so I, I feel could like film. you must take the shinkansen a lot for work. Yeah. Yeah. Last year I was traveling a lot um, for work with the shinkansen. Mm -hmm. But I, was, I really love it still. I love it just like the first day. Mm -hmm. I've only been on the shinkansen once. Really? Yeah. <gasps> but I like fluffy eyebrows, so you're gonna mm -hmm. have. Yeah, fluffy, fluffy is eyebrows. good. Make them fluffy. I like that too. This is the best product in the world. It's the tiniest little bottle, but it's called Freck, and it's the perfect product to do faux freckles. Oh. It almost looks like a tint. Mm -hmm. So what you do is mm -hmm. tap some on. I'm gonna tap some on for people. Boop, 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 boop. And then you take your finger. Mm. And you blend it out. So it kind of like picks up some of the tint on your finger and then spreads around the freckle. Why do I feel like it makes you look more German? <laughs> well, you know, you remind me of Anne of Green Cables. <laughs> so, like, when I see you with the pigtails and the reddish kind of hair. What happened to the eyeliner? No eyeliner. What happened to the mascara? We are gonna do the mascara, but I put the mascara on last. looking at it yeah look at it look at it wait <laughs> I'm nervous wait okay <laughs> okay I'm nervous okay look three two one oh, wow it's different right who's that girl who's that girl I'm that girl <laughs> <laughs> wow I didn't know you could create such an effect without eyeliner I think the fake freckles are really good because they cute, kind of right? draw on the cuteness feel of the yeah. whole thing. With all the product that you put on, I was mm. like, 
I'm like, gonna look, especially with the bronze and the darker colors, I'm like, mm. I'm gonna look older kind of thing, but the freckles kind of bring it back out. I again. love freckles. That really works. Now you you are in your regular Lolita fashion, and we're gonna change you to something <laughs> I would wear. Are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Oh, uh, three, two, one. Wow, look at how cute Thank you look. Okay, now let's go outside and take some pictures. Let's do it. Kathy, how do you feel? Oh, I feel like basic Japanese girl had <laughs> like basic Japanese fashion because I've seen loads of girls with this kind of style in yeah. Harajuku. Yeah. And um, that's good. And I the think you look great. The thing is, yeah. everyone who's now staring, they're staring at you. <laughs> we have literally changed places. We have swapped. So how does it feel to get looked at like that? Uh, interesting. <laughs> Uncomfortable. I need like two shots of vodka and then I'll be good. Right now the director of Astro Beauty is going to take pictures of us, but what's quite funny is he looks like the camera guy. I look like, like the manager and yeah. you look like the idol talento person. Uh, so, this, this is how you feel. I'm in your life right now. Work it, girl. You look amazing. So as you can see, I put Kathy in a draped leather jacket because that's really popular right now in Japan to be draping your jackets and Japanese fashion is kind of like everyday girl fashion is all about layers so we got her in a turtleneck we got her in a half vest and kind of like a velour velour velvet faux velvet skirt so essentially I'm mixing the textures of the black and then we got thigh high boots on to give her some warmth and a little headband up top to match Thank you so much for being with me on this video. No, thank you she so much. She looks amazing. Doesn't she look great? <laughs> like you better tell me down below in the comment section that she looks amazing. Okay. Yes. Okay. And come over and check out her video on my channel. Yes. It's a real process. It's a lot of it fun. It is. Yes. And I had a lot of fun. The erection was beautiful. <laughs> Saying a lot. <laughs> All right. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.